This week we read a portion of Shemini, and the Torah tells us how on the eighth day of the inauguration of the Mishkan, Aaron and his children enter into the Mishkan, the El Moed, and they begin doing the services of that day. The entire service of the day is done with Aaron and his children, as the Jewish people witness it. And then Aaron blesses the Jewish people, and finally that moment that the Jewish people are waiting for, but takes the age of a heavenly fire comes down, consumes the sacrifices, and the Shechina, the Divine Presence, rests in the Mishkan. The Jewish people see it, and all in unison, they cry out praise to the Almighty. This Shabbos is the 28th of the month of Nisan. It's a day that we read this portion, and it reminds us that we have the power we were empowered by God to bring down the Shekhinah, to bring down God's presence into this world. And it is within our reach. It, it, it's our responsibility to do whatever we can to see to it that the third base of Mikdash, the Holy Temple, should, is rebuilt. Where once again, as it was for the very first time, God will again come down into this base of Mikdash and rest here. But this time much greater and in, more, in a more permanent way than ever before. So let's connect with the special energy of this Shabbos. And all of us should cry out together that we want Mashiach. We want the third base of Mikdash. We want to see the revelation of God in this other was the very first time. And we want it on a permanent basis to be with us forever and ever to the end of time. May God bless us to be successful in our mission and to accomplish our goal and to bring Mashiach now. Shabbat Shalom.